Hello everybody, Kyle Gray here with another episode on NeverEnding Legacy with the Magics mod. So for my first two episodes, which will be linked below, I have pretty much found out that this game is way more difficult than the original game, but I wouldn't have it any other way. I always thought the original game was too easy anyway. Speaking of which, the game will be linked below. Anyway, like, subscribe, and let's turn these people's frowns upside down. Yeah, I doubt that's gonna happen. <laughs> so it has been like, two-ish weeks since I played this game last. So, I mean, I don't think I'm ever gonna run out of ticks at this point. Where was I last time? Food's really not a problem right now. So, uh, I decided that this guy probably... No, not that guy. This guy. Because he generates faith and happiness. So maybe he can help us bring... <laughs> help bring us out of this rut we're in. I don't think he will, but... Hey, who knows? How does somebody die from disease? I have a healer. Wait a second. Is he not working? This is active. Wait, am I not producing this right now? Oh yeah, I'm producing it, even though all the work is back. He seems to be a bit happier. Another baby's been born, that's great. Wait a second. Oh, the baby just grew up, that's what happened. <laughs> Cause there's only one here. I, I forgot I was going super fast mode. What's this? Salt. Oh, cool. Oh, I just ate the salt. That's nasty. So my first goal will probably be to get these mud shelters all up and running. The reason for that is maybe my people are gonna be happier when they're all in houses. I don't know. Anything to try to make my people more happy, I guess. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I need to warn you, in the next 20 years, something bad will start to occur. Huh? If you think that you can deal without ascending by mausoleum, you are mistaken. Ascend as soon as possible. <laughs> I don't think that's gonna happen. <laughs> There's no such thing as years, I'm not sure how close I am. <laughs> oh, I'm so fucked. <laughs> Let's just see what happens. I'll end the video once, uh, I die, I guess. Like, this guy is just not even doing enough work to make a difference. Like, he's making a little bit of happiness, but, uh... Not enough to make a substantial difference, so, uh, you're out. What actually can I do? Yeah, I don't need burial. Wood cutting? Sure. Oof. Okay, this actually might be pretty good to have. Let's hope that, uh, this is not as bad as it says. I only have 12 adults. I hope they're gonna start repopulating. At least soon, that is. It's raining. Good to know. There you go. Now we're all housed. So, uh, that's probably a good thing, right? I wanna get this, but that's a lot of insight I need. So why are my people happy? No clothing. Food culture. Wait a second. Wait a second. Yeah, I probably should let him eat more food, now that I'm thinking about it. Food rations. I'll change it to sufficient. There you go. Let's, let's see if they get happy from having more food. I mean, I would be. Soon I'm gonna start telling him to eat the spoiled food, by the way. Whoa, ha 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 ha. People have adopted the fear of death. Okay, I know what that is. They just hate seeing dead corpses. Uh, good thing, uh, we've been throwing ours down the river this whole time. I'm gonna try to have a hunter. Uh, but they may be wounded, but I do have a healer now, so I don't think it matters. Because we need some way to be happy. Like, maybe get some meat, get more food, but... Yeah, I'll just throw them all there, I guess. I don't really don't know. Still waiting for that 20 years to pass, so I get five. I think the more food we have, the happier we'll be, honestly. That might be wrong. Hey, my houses were destroyed. What? I need more mud. What? What? I just... I saw myself get one. Where'd it go? <sighs> Come on. Just one more. There you go. I saw that one. Don't take it away from me this time. Kari Raffi. <sighs> Is it a policy to eat um, Hmm. Hmm. I mean, health and morale is already pretty low. <laughs> I think right now we're doing fine. We have 16 population. An aging population, but uh, we're alive. I think the biggest problem will be food. Okay, I'm not going to click this regular button for the remainder of the episode and see what happens. Until I want to research something, that is. Message memory? Message history increases? I'm actually kind of curious what that is. Alphabet one-third. I mean, this is some cool stuff, I gotta admit. I need a lot of culture for that one, though, so... Later. Whoa, no, 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 no. Beware of thievery. It will occur since now. Soon your people will start to punish them. Craft equipment for them so they will be even easier to deal. Thieves are unhappy adults. <laughs> they will show their unhappiness by committing crimes. Even 200% happiness won't decrease their spawn rate to zero. Citizens, except kids, have a chance to die to thieves. <laughs> or to beat him up. Oh no, everyone is going to kill each other. Come on, why did we adopt this? Well, nothing I can do about it. I hope they don't kill the healer. Oh no. I don't have any of that stuff. You know, if people start killing each other, they're gonna start eating rotting food. I'm just hoping I get lucky and no one starts to be an asshole. I mean, maybe I shouldn't feed them, then they won't have the energy to do it. Does that make me a bad person? I would think so. Let's get the message. I got the message of memory. I don't know exactly what that does. Uh, scouting. What? Huh? Coordination. Oh, defunders, I don't care. 
I have the weird feeling I'm supposed to be much further than I am right now. Symbolism. Oh, I lost culture. What? Just about to click it, too. Your people have adopted the knowledge. Primary time measure. Two centuries. I don't know how they adopted that, but, uh, good on them. Eventually. One more that I can get the other thing that would really help me right now. Honestly, mostly anything can help me now, but this. That's very good. Well digging. That might be nice, actually. Skinning. I don't need that. I don't hunt. Tile inspection. I'll get skinning. Building. Okay, I'll probably get building then. Henceforth, you can dig a well. Why wouldn't you teach the others to set up the first well? Well's a source of fresh water. But only one well per ten pieces of land can be constructed. Okay. Well, well, well. There you go. That means they can drink to their heart's content now. You know what? Yeah, give her water. You can drink it now because we have plenty of it. You know what? I'm going to be a good guy. A very good guy. Drink all the water you need. <laughs> Drink all the water you need. We have plenty of it for uh, 15 people, well, 16 people now, but maybe I'll even have a smooth sayer to try to make people happy. <laughs> nope, need more houses. I like that no one has started killing yet. That's very nice of me. Well, not of me. I didn't do anything, but nice of them. Oh, health is actually on the rise, though. It's 8% now. <laughs> They're starting to get healthier. Maybe I'm doing something right. I doubt it, but maybe. They can have all the water they need, so that's always nice. Artistic thinking. That sounds fine. Storytellers are more efficient. Open war informs fire. Okay. It's, what? Hmm? Painter? <laughs> well, how do I get dice? Um, how far does this game expect me to be at this point? Because I honestly, I'm not as far as they think. Building. Woo. I guess I can do storage pits. I don't know what they do, but sure. Alphabet, one third. I might want to do that. I don't know. Mining, don't want that yet. Yeah, I'm going to go with alphabet one third. I don't know where I'm going to end this video, because it doesn't look like, cross my fingers, that I'm going to die. Wait, I can have more houses. How do you make them? Is this 100 materials? Really? That's a pretty nice house. Because no, my dig boys aren't coming to work, though. We have food. Well, we have a little bit of food. We eat bugs, too, so. I like that uh, no one has tried to kill each other yet. I was actually scared that people were going to start thieving from each other, but I guess it helps when everyone has nothing. So why are people angry? Closed darkness. There's a fire. How is there darkness? At least we have plenty of housing right now. One eternity later. Alphabet one third. Now we can uh, say the alphabet from A to uh, G maybe? No, G's not a third. I don't know, I'll probably put it somewhere on the screen now. You managed to make people being able to write. Well, not everyone has readable writing yet. Okay, great. I actually don't like eat any of these, but I'm just gonna get canoes, I guess. <laughs> I don't even know if we're near water, but sure. Yeah, I think after canoes I might end the video. I made a lot of progress today, don't get me wrong, but... Die from starvation. You know what? I didn't want to do this to you guys. Meager. Sorry. We just need to survive. Sorry, guys. We just need food. And so you guys gotta starve. Sorry. A few moments later. Do you know what? Nah, I can't do this to you guys. You guys had to have a sufficient amount of food. Okay, so what's the last research I'm doing for this episode? It's definitely not gonna be this. I'm probably gonna reroll. Maybe I'll get code of law. I mean, the last thing uh this needs is some laws, but I think we'll get it. Why not, right? It's only 20. My rule of thumb is just get as many gatherers as possible. Wait, what storage do? Use food storage until it slows down decay of food. Oh, that's cool. That's pretty nice, I guess. What's this? It's material store. Whoa! -ho! Whoa! Whoa! This is like you're doing pretty well. <laughs> it's been 150 years since you started Magic Adventure with Magic's Edition. Thank you for playing with this expansion. Your playing makes mod better and motivates for future updates. Remember, mod is still getting bigger and gets more content. This means someday this, the mod may be unavailable to play for a while. If you will lose progress due to update, we are sorry. Anyway, keep enjoying the adventure. Farewell. Hey, uh, thank you for making it, I guess. It is very difficult, though. <laughs> okay. So let's get the last upgrade for the video, which is Code of Law. Okay. So here is where I'm going to end the video. So if you liked the video, why not consider leaving a like? And if you're new, subscribe if you want to subscribe. So I again would like to thank Palastar PL for making this mod. I don't know if he made it alone. Regardless, Palastar's YouTube channel will be linked below. So go check him out. Regarding this game, well, I survived another episode. Anyway, I'll see you all in the next video. See ya!